Good morning, Brent. One more morning towards our inevitable deaths. Excuse me? Face it, Cole. We're done. Spent. Old. We have but a handful of moments left to enjoy before they slip like sand through our fingers. We're not that old. The Trinity High School Alumni Association would highly disagree with you. Read it and weep. Hello, Trinity High School alumni. We hope you're excited about your 10-year class reunion. Wow, 10 years? My back hurts. My knees ache. Lord knows I can't eat anything even remotely greasy after 9 p.m. or I'll be spending the night on the porcelain perch. When did we get so old? Stop it. We're not that old. This is going to be awesome. Wait. You're not actually planning on going to this thing, are you? Of course. I mean, you gotta go to your 10-year reunion. It's a rite of passage. Well, you get to see how everyone changed, catch up with your old friends. It's been a decade since we saw them last. Don't call it a decade. Come on, you don't, you don't want to go back and see everyone from high school? Have you forgotten what everyone was like back in high school? Hey, Sarah. Losers. <coughs> oh, yeah. Right. My prostate hurts. Yeah. Hey, kid, is this the offices of PVP Magazine or is this Cosmo? <laughs> God, I wish it was Cosmo. That would be so hot. <laughs> it's a classy rag. Listen, I'm looking for Cole the Mole Richards. Here I am? Uh, yeah. He's in the break room. Down that hall. Thanks, kid. Here's a little something something for your trouble. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go pick up a Cosmo. Hey, you don't think it'd be kinda cool to see everyone from the old days? Yeah. Can't wait to see how all those chicks that used to give me boners got all ugly and fat. All I have are my memories, Cole. Leave me that. Name one person you knew in high school, other than myself, of course, that you would want to see now. Um, well, um... Actually, there was one guy. What was his name? I used to hang out with him all the time. God, he was funny as hell. What was his name? Uh, Matt? Matt something? Max? Max, yeah. Max Powers? Yeah, that guy was hilarious. <laughs> I wouldn't mind hanging out with Max again. Max Powers? Are you kidding me? I, he was a total jerk. He was hilarious. He used to torment me. In hilarious ways? He would always see me from across campus and run over with that fake smile and, and that cheesy voice would slither out over those fake teeth and he would say, Call the mole! Max, holy crap, we were just talking about you! <laughs> I thought my ears were burning. You know, I just couldn't wait for the reunion. I had to get the jump on things by dropping in on my two favorite guys. <laughs> this is one Heck of a surprise. Oh, Cole, you haven't changed a bit. Except for your hairline and the extra 40 pounds, it's like walking into a yearbook. Ha <laughs> ha, zing! <laughs> <laughs> this guy. Jeez, Cole, you own your own business and you still have to wear a tie? I'm telling you, this was my place. Nothing would stop me from showing up naked every day. That's what I keep telling him. <laughs> 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 I want that ass out of my office. Dude, what is your problem? My problem is that Max Powers was a total jerk to me, and here he is, being a jerk all over again. The first thing he says to me in ten years is that I'm fat and bald. It's high school all over again. Oh, you're overreacting. He's just ribbing you. That's just his way of saying he loves you. Yeah. Anyone who bribes a minor with cash can't be all bad. Brent, you never dealt with it, but I was always the punching bag when he showed up. If you think I'm going to put up with that as an adult... Are you really going to keep some grudge from high school? We're all adults now. Start acting like one. Isn't that the fun of a reunion? Seeing how everyone has changed? Max Powers hasn't changed a bit. You can go to the reunion if you want, but if Max is going, I'm not. Suit yourself, but come reunion night after Max and I tear up the town and you're all sad because you didn't go, you're going to be sorry. And I won't tell you that I told you so because that's how Jesus would handle it. You would think it, but never say it. <laughs> and Principal Murray never figured it out? Uh, how could he? The only evidence was an empty bottle of shampoo and a tube of lipstick. <laughs> Man, you could get away with anything. Yep, uh, those were the days. Hey, do you think Ann Mossman is going to show up? Ann Mossman? My Ann Mossman? <laughs> Your Ann Mossman? <laughs> Please, you never had the guts to ask her out. <laughs> Nobody did. She was a goddess. Everyone was afraid to ask her out. Well, not everyone. <laughs> you 
dated Ann Mossman? Oh boy, I'm not sure uh, dated is the appropriate word. <laughs> she was a real firecracker, that one. Hot to trot. <laughs> Max Powers must die. I've dreamt about this day for ten years, Brent. The day we finally make Max Powers pay for everything he did to me. And Ann Mossman. What did he do to uh, Ann Mossman? Don't make me think about that, Cole! We need to do something. Something big. Something to knock him down off his pedestal. Really humiliate him the way he humiliated me. And Ann. Wait! I've got it! On the night of the reunion, we'll all meet up here. Then, before we leave, we invite him in here to have some shots to toast our friendship. When he comes through the door, BAM! A bucket of pig's blood comes down on his head! Pig's blood? Like in Carrie. I never saw that movie. Trust me, nothing says taking you down a peg like a bucket of pig's blood. Where are we supposed to get pig's blood? I know a guy. Come on, guys! What's taking you guys so long? We're gonna be late to the dance! <laughs> I am never late to the dance. <laughs> Except for that time Ann Mossman and I missed the senior formal in the back seat of my car. <laughs> Am I right or what? <laughs> yeah, we got plenty of time. I wanted to do something classy to commemorate our reunion tonight. I thought maybe we could toast to our renewed friendship with a couple of shots before we head over. Oh, yeah. After you. Let's get blotto, boys. Uh, hey, listen, guys. Um, I can't thank you enough for this. I know I always seem like the cool guy, but to be honest... I was always jealous of your friendship. Cole, that's why I tormented you. And Brent, I only dated Ann Mossman because you liked her so much. Aw, Max. Damn it, Max. I guess in a way, I was just trying to impress you. Well, I just wanted to say, thanks for making me feel like one of the guys. <laughs> now, how about those shots? Oh, Max, Max wait. wait! Morning, Brent. One more morning towards our inevitable deaths. Well, last night was kind of fun. Yeah, if you don't count watching Max make out with Ann Mossman. Well, she still looks great. Dealing with your drinking problem was no fun either. I didn't get that drunk. You hit on Mrs. Mumford, dude. Mrs. Mumford. What is she now, 60? I always had a crush on her. <sighs> well, despite our change of heart about Max, I'm happy he's gone. Thank God we won't have to see him again for another 10 years. See, this is why I didn't want to go to the reunion. Here, with you... We're the cool guys, but out there, in the wild, we're just old, pathetic nerds clinging to our youth. For once, Brent, you're right. Thank you. You know, from now on, I vow to let nothing I've done in the past haunt me today.